All right, hello everyone, my name is Enzo Dan, and welcome back to Prison Architect. We are in our maximum security prison, where we also have super max dudes who are on permanent lockdown. Um, in, the last, in the last episode, we actually lost an armed guard to Adam Griffin again. I think he has maybe killed... Oh. Uh, I, I don't even know how many people he's killed, but it's it's got to be something... At least three, I think. So, I mean... He took the shotgun of our armed guard and he shot him with it. So it's it's painful, really. <sighs> yeah. We've got a lot of prisoners cleaning the prison, which is very good, I think. We also have a shop now, which I like, because that gives people an opportunity to spend their money. Like this guy. He's shopping right now. And there's no one at the counter, so he's going to be angry, probably. He's got seven bucks, though. Let's take a look at how many... Yeah, there we go. He's got a shampoo, I think it is. And that cost him five bucks, but at least, I mean, he now has uh, some interesting stuff to take home to his cell. Very nice. I like it. So that's, I think, I'm, an, I'm hoping that that will bring uh, more more people in uh, into uh, our programs of work. Uh, ah, we had four persons, four people interested in uh, workshop safety, but now it's down to three. Oh, well. Okay, so, plans for this episode. We, oh, want to make sure this guy has a toilet to use. And now he does. Yes, you can go to the toilet. Um, I want to make a spiritual guidance home for everyone, where they can go and come to their senses. Eh, maybe. This would be an interesting place here. Right next to the classrooms. Yes. And then also a workshop, which probably will be somewhere around here as well. Maybe we can place them side by side. We could maybe build a, a uh, corridor here. And then make sure that... Yeah, actually that's interesting. Because otherwise, these guys will probably have to walk all the way around to get to the entrances of these buildings. But if we just go and make a, uh, a corridor here. Um, and then build off of that from south to north, right? Uh, we can make a, um, a spiritual guidance home and a uh, workshop. I think that works uh, very nice. So, let's do that right now. And we'll, I think we'll just go like this gonna cost us 15k that's fine we've got the money and then we'll build a wall here yes okay so let's see where we need to bulldoze we will come in here and here and could yeah we could go in there as well well it doesn't know it's not that's not necessary okay did that actually work yeah I think it worked okay so get to work my little lemmings get to work again I want to sell some um, stacks we could also just uh, maybe increase the size here of this room of our storage room like so Just so that we don't have any boxes laying around in the prison. Because I don't like boxes laying around. Okay, we're getting to work. I do want to extend this perimeter wall at some point. Ah! Adam Griffin, why are you here? This doesn't make any sense. You should be in there. You can't be in there with permanent lockdown because you can't do anything. Okay, deployments. Uh, max sack. Ah, yes, these deployments have uh, been uh, screwed up, basically. We could set this to max sack only as well. Because that would mean that the, um, Adam Griffin can't go to solitary anymore. And I like it. And you should just go in there. I think that should work. Yeah, there's a guard coming. Very nice. And there he goes. Ah, a Polaroid. Uh, okay, janitor. I like it. I hope he goes away. Yes. 
look at this. Adam Griffin immediately getting to work on the wage bench. Exercise, recreation. Oh, that's good. Recreation as well. Maybe it's because the radio's on, but I am... Yeah, I think it's it. That's it. Because he's still getting recreation. I was, I thought he was, it was because of the wage, wage bench, but no. This is taking a long time, though. Because of the, um, of the forest that's there. I guess you could call it that. Okay, so we've got quite a lot of guards actually free. So that's good. Shop is working fine. People are having a place to spend their money. And still, we only have... Well, we've got four people interested in the workshop qualification now. Oh, this is going to take a long time before this is finished. But at least that will bring us uh, some interesting stuff. By the way, I want to bulldoze this as well. And I think we will leave this shower here. We could make it into two cells, but I like this. It lowers the risk for the rest of the prison. The more people are spread out, the less uh, likely it's going to be that they are uh, going to be uh, horrible to each other. And this guy is going to be horrible. It's only 8 a.m. in the morning. <sighs> Just go to sleep already. Get out, get out. Thank you. I, I wish we could tell these guards to not go into Adam Griffin's cell uh, if they are alone, basically. But next time we are going to set to free fire. And that's probably going to be the end of Adam Griffin. Yeah, he's, he's actually to sleep. Okay, very good. So, I think we will make it another day without an issue. Okay, that's good. These guards are still very busy working on this. Uh, we do have a fence, right? Yes. Otherwise, probably we would have um, people already escaped by now. And there we go. Building's finished. Very good. Okay, let's create a wall. And behind that wall, we ha we will have our um, our buildings. Could maybe split it in two. Because this is a long way out. In that case, we might want to split this up as well and create another corridor here. Okay, there we go. This is going to be a workshop. And then on this side, we will probably split this up, like so. And actually, um, like, where's the corridor going to be here? So this is going to be a door, this is going to be a door, and this is going to be a door as well. I'm not sure what we are going to use this for, maybe an additional workshop. Uh, but yeah, at least we will have this space a bit more efficiently used. Of course, we will have to demolish some stuff straight after it's built. Ah, eh, but that's all right, right? And maybe like this, and then like this. Yeah. And then probably like this and this. Okay. So workshop uh, needs the oh, Griffin. Free fire. Shoot him. Shoot him. Yes. Do it again. Adam Griffin is dead. I mean, I'm sorry I was I was rooting for him to be killed, but really, this guy. He's brought us so much pain and so much death. And we we I mean we tried to make it we to make him happy or at least satisfied with prison life whoops that was my microphone but it didn't work it just didn't work so now he's dead but look at these stats as well extremely strong extremely tough extremely volatile as well which is probably a reason why he was uh, misbehaving so much stoical fearless and an expert fighter as well there was just no way 
part of me feels sorry though that he is now gone because he brought us so much tension <laughs> and and events. Uh, I just, I mean, we we just couldn't, we just couldn't have him kill another guard. It it had run out of control. Okay, well that was that. Interesting. Um, are these guys gonna be locked up? I think they might be. Although I think I de did designate where they should demolish the walls, so probably they should be able to get themselves out. Yeah, there we go. Okay, rooms. Here we go. We will get a. I'm not sure what it's called actually. By the way, a, a Morik, I mean, I'm not sure. We've got a hearse, right? Not sure why it's uh, it's it's necessary. Uh, rooms. I was working on a uh, workshop. It's gonna be here. Let's just designate it straight away. And then we will have. Ooh, library could be interesting. Chapel. That's the name I was looking for all the time. There we go. Okay, let's get our chapel up and running first because I think there's quite a lot of dudes who want their chapel. Um, now I'm not sure how to put this. There's no way to tell, I think. In the interest of that, let's do it like this. Oh, and I always forget how to put these down as well. I mean, these are... You kneel on these, right? It's not benches. Let's let's go with that. I'm not sure if I'm right. I'm just going to roll with it. And then our prayer mats as well. In no particular order. Let me be clear. And there we go. And let's go like this. I think that should be fine-ish. Actually, that's not fine-ish. This is better. Yeah, there you go. Okay. So that should be fine, I think. And then we'll probably uh, program a uh, spiritual guided session. I'm not sure if it, whoops, if it works, though. Um, no, it doesn't work yet because it, the room is not finished. Okay. I'm going to wait until this uh, room is finished before we uh, move on to the workshop. It's the marshal wall there. All these um, locks, though. Jeez. Come on. I guess I guess we could make some more storage. Maybe maybe one of these rooms could be storage. Whoa. We should, we need a bin. I think a bin. Is that is that it? Yeah. Like so. And then one here as well. Prison is so ugly as well. But look at this shotgun. Oh dear. And I think yeah, let's let's just make this a storage room for now at least. We can always move it move it somewhere else. But I hate the fact that we still don't have enough room to store everything we have. We do need a staff door here though. There you go. I'm tempted to also put down a uh, metal detector, but hey. Talking about metal detectors, let's place two of them there. I'm getting used to actually searching with the uh, by typing, which I think works quite nicely. Okay, we got four prisoners coming in. Very good. Everyone's going to take a shower. Oh, this is quite dangerous though, I have to say. No, that's not going to work. Well, it's going to work if we put a cell here, uh, a door there. Oh well. Yes, okay, people moving storage. I like how these guys are just walking through walls. Very efficient. Nice. Uh, so many stuff. Uh, stuffs to move around. A lot of stuff to move around. Oh well. 
Let's see if this works. Like so. Yes. Now the altar is left. I like the, how the prison looks though. It seems to work fine. The yard could be a bit bigger. So we will probably do that at some point. Not don't. Okay, very good. Thought he was moving outside, but luckily no. Garbage coming in. Deliveries are fine. Laundry seems to be working fine as well. Yeah. These prayer mats though. Oh dear. I think our janitors are doing a good job of keeping this clean now as well, because we've got so many prisoners working uh, the rest of the prison. Oh, look at this. Very good. Just praying. Is that the free time thing as well? I mean, why would we use the spiritual guidance then? Some prisoners are religious or have a general need for some spirituality. Bring a spiritual leader from the local community to lead them through prayers and instill a sense of calm amongst your prisoners. Yeah. Okay, let's just do it. It's 250 a session, so it's, I mean, it's doable. Okay, very nice. Uh, whoa, what was that? That was weird. Workshop safety. Six people are interested right now. Very good. Um, I'm also thinking to maybe get rid of that one guard to make sure that our guard, our people aren't um, suppressed all the time. It looks to be fine-ish. Well, actually, this guy is fully suppressed. As is um, are most people. But don't forget that these are um, maximum security prisoners. So it makes sense. Uh, also, I want to place I want to place doors here, and then metal detectors. So I don't trust you guys to not take with you any tools. It's just too dangerous. Okay, we need a desk, I think, office desk. Um, let's place it somewhere around here so that our dude who is going to teach the classes doesn't have to work too f uh, uh, walk too far. And I think we will probably use tables all around. Or maybe, no, that's a bit much. Let's do it like this. And then we'll get these uh, saws. Like so. These things are so expensive, though. Uh, like so. And then carpeted tables, uh, maybe in the back. I don't know. And then place tables there as well to place our logs on. And by the way, that's probably that probably means that we won't need this storage anymore because we will be losing all of these stacks of logs. But that's fine. We can always remove this. Seems to work nicely though, uh, but apparently we don't have... Ah! There we go. That's better. I think. Not sure. No, it wasn't even necessary. Oh well. It just hadn't been placed yet. Just needed to be patient. Because I think... Uh, we have benches, you know. Why are you placing all of this? Yeah, oh, come on. <laughs> He's the, they're just dropping it inside the workshop. It's like, hey, you, you've got your stacks. Now go and be happy. And that's not how it works. Got quite some space here to expand. That's nice. Uh, that's going to be four more cells. Yeah. Uh, no, maybe even more. If we do it the same way as this side. So that's going to be six more. S no, four. Yeah, six more cells. Very good. Now, please just drop this on the tables. Yes. Good guy. Very nice. You are going to have to be searched because you... Oh, okay, there you go. Apparently, this is not working right now. No. Okay, so this was very, very expensive. But it does mean that we can now hopefully make money of this. 
Yeah, okay. They're placing it on the tables now. That's good. What's that? Oh, nothing's happening. Adam Griffin has made me paranoid. Okay, so this is going to be fine, I think. Uh, maybe another table here. Just because of the sheer amount of stacks that we have. And they are still coming in. Look at all. There's, there's still more as well. Oh, well. Uh, I think we're going to do a shakedown again tonight. Because I don't trust my prisoners one bit. And I don't like this. Uh, so let's get our electrical cable up to there. Uh, yeah, let's do a shakedown. <laughs> Shotgun. <laughs> Dog leash. Well, yeah, that, you can kill someone with the dog leash, I suppose. So that's going to be... The, oh, look at this. We need to search all of these. Are you kidding me? At least they're in the same place now. That helps. Oh, by the way, we need to, of course... Oh, mobile, uh, mobile, mobile cell phones. Workshop safety, start. Foundation education, yes. Alcoholics group therapy, yes. And reschedule. Okay. I don't think anything changed, but I like this. This is good. Foundation education. I think 10 prisoners. And then one prisoner passed general education. That's the thing that comes after that. I think it's basically elementary school, right? I'm not sure if that's going to be of any help for these maximum security prisoners, but we might as well try. It's going to cost us quite a lot of money. Oh, well. Okay, shakedown is going fairly nicely. Taking another sip of my drink. Ooh! That was bad. How did he get a knife? Even though he's on um, lockdown permanently. Probably from his food? I don't know. Not. I mean. Uh, I hope that, that they're not handing out these knives on the trays. That would be. A bad idea. Okay, so what did we found with you guys? Uh, drugs and drugs. Okay. That's fine. I'm not gonna bump you up to Supermax for that. And how about you? You found drugs. Okay. That's fine. Uh, okay, so the workshop is ready. Aside from all of these logs just being here. I don't like that. <laughs> Suspicious logs. I don't I don't trust them. Okay, yeah, very good. Showering. It seems to be a bit crowded in here, so I'm happy I, I left this one in uh, at least. Uh we might yeah, I think we'll when we expand we'll probably uh expand here, build more cells and then build another shower here, just like the one on this side so that we spread out a bit more okay so it's eating time i think everyone is getting their food yes aside from the people in solitary actually they've left already so it should be fine i have a feeling that we are probably gonna need a, uh, a guard in the workshop Everyone's coming in. Can we please have a guard in here? I want to see what's going on there. Thank you. Okay, so let's see. Success chance, 40%. How long until... Oh, look at this guy. Success, 100%. Is it just one training? Uh, probably. Virtual guidance... Three past. Carpentry. That's zero people interested. Uh, workshop. Yeah, okay. Uh, and by the way, of course, we need to set as many prisoners here as possible. Uh, maybe put some more in laundry as well. And then some more here. Maybe there. No, that's not, that's not necessary. Uh, yeah, that works. Okay. 
Because I think these locks, I mean, that's work as well, I think. So even if you don't have a uh, certification yet for the workshop, I think you can still... Unable to be assigned to a cell? Why? Oh, no free cells! Well, that's a shame. And how did that happen? Well, I know. We'll just build a new one. Is it because we lost one Supermax dude? We could bump someone up to Supermax, but it feels kind of random to do that. So what we'll do is just um, use our clone tool. No, that's the wrong side, though. Uh, like so. And build two more cells. And I think we already have the utilities, yes. So this should be done very quickly. Especially if the tools are right there. That's nice. And this guy will hopefully... Quickly get a cell. Mm, yep, there we go. Nice. Well, that was fixed quite nicely. Very good. Okay, so when showering in his free time, that's that's fair enough. Still, all those logs, I don't like it, but it's gonna be fine. Got the reform program going on, I think. Oh, it's a uh, group therapy, yeah. Success chance, 1%. It's not very good, is it? Oh, well. Okay, storage is doing fine. All those logs are gone. And, I, yeah, I think we'll just get rid of this storage now. We don't need it anymore. There's just two things in here. We can just um, move it aside. Oh, do we have an exports? I don't think we do, no. So, we'll get exports, and I think we can do that on this side. Yep. Now, I'm hoping that we're not going to move all those locks to there. And actually, we are. Well, okay. I, I mean, that's sort of fine, I suppose. Uh, I was hoping to actually use it on the carpentry table, table, but I don't think we have anyone who can use it, so that's fine. We've got a knife there. Okay, so we, we basically just pulled all of the stuff from storage to the workshop and now back to exports. At least we're going to make a lot of money from it, as you can tell. 1700 bucks right there. But that feels mm, so inefficient. I don't like inefficiency. I like to be efficient. And this was not efficient. Oh well. How are you doing? Freedom. Spirituality, yeah. See, I'm not quite sure how we can help him with that. It would be interesting if we could have the uh, chapel leader going to his cell. And maybe read the Bible to him or something. But I don't think that's a thing. Oh. Ah! Oh dear. Oh, dear. Okay, someone died. Killed for being a snitch. Well, yeah, not much I can do about that. This guy is going to Supermax straight away, it seems, and he's going to be on permanent lockdown. There you go. You just made life real hard for yourself, dude. Attack prisoner. Um, skilled fighter as well. I think you will go to Supermax as well. And you will be on permanent lockdown, too. Anyone else? Anyone else going to go to Supermax? Oh, you are actually uh, attack prisoner. Okay, you will go to permanent lockdown as well, and you are Supermax already. Okay. Well, I mean, a snitch. Yeah, that's gonna happen from time to time. Uh, I think we. The only thing we can. Ooh, the only thing we can do is to. Um, is to have a. Uh, uh, secure wing while well, we have snitches. Now I'm curious to see if we have enough cells left for uh, these guys in Supermax. Right now it looks fine. Although these guys are not being moved. 
And that's a problem because again, he's not he doesn't have everything he needs inside of here. I still don't really understand how this works though. Max, max. Everything's set fine. Super max. That's better, I suppose. Janitor, very nice. He was just about to share. He's moved within the prison uh, naked. You are going to be moved as well. You seem to be another one of those supermax dudes. You are going to be moved as well. So how many supermax dudes do we now have? I want to see. Uh, prisoners. One, two, three, four, five... Ah, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Actually, we do have enough cells for every one of them. Um, who, who? I think you are going to be... Let's just wait and let's see what's going to happen because I, I did click some people away. I want to see which cells are actually going to be occupied. So now we found ourselves in a situation where we might actually need to lower security level for some of these guys we've got one cell free so there should be someone who is not in his in the correct cell I think it's Whitley where are you Whitley Whitley get yourself over here okay you're gonna be moved buddy okay so let's see we've got permanent lockdown permanent lockdown permanent lockdown Permanent lockdown, permanent lockdown, permanent lockdown, and permanent lockdown. Okay, I think I think we're fine. I I just love this janitor. Look at him go. It's actually very good. It means our um, system is working. Okay, so he's in solitary for two hours. And he's in solitary for five hours. I think we do actually need to make that available to them. Otherwise, those those um, sentences will just be there all the time. So we will place a jail door here and then set this to everyone, basically. Another thing that we could do is set these to solitary and then have them permanently in solitary this by the way works straight away nice uh, but I'm not sure if they get food in solitary so let's not do that we've got seven prisoners arriving because of the fact that we've moved everyone to um, so many people to uh, supermax uh, I think seven is a bit much but it's gonna be fine oh well that's because of our exports yeah and why do we not move all of these to export? Apparently, are these full stacks? Maybe that's what's going on? No. Well, then I'm not quite sure what's going on. Four hours of lockdown. Two hours, 40 minutes. Yeah, okay, so should be fine there. I don't think that they will throw a tan tantrums. Any tantrums? Um, do we have enough cookers here? I think it should be fine. Okay. Um, yeah, we've been going on for a bit too long, so we'll put in a cut for now. Uh, Adam Griffin died, you guys. Big moment in our lives in this prison. Uh, yeah, uh, we've got enough supermax dudes to uh, to honor his memory. So we'll see what's gonna happen next. Uh, by the way, this is sort of dangerous. We might need to build a a fence here as well. Although I'm not quite sure if these guys are gonna try and get out of here. We'll see. In any case, I want to thank you guys for watching this episode. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to see you again in the next one. Until then, bye-bye.